What's going on YouTube? It's your boy OGT Nien, and today we got um, YDDG has beef with Plaque Boy Max by JMB Fargo. I ain't gonna lie, this nigga is fire when it comes to you know breaking down shit and letting us know the nitty gritty. <sighs> Sorry, needed that water in my system. Make sure to drink you a bottle of water every day, or three, or two, nigga. Some of y'all might need five or six, but I digress. Um, uh, make sure you like, come, subscribe on the road to 10k at 2300. I will be doing hour long or close to hour long vlog. Um, yeah, at 5k, I'll be doing doing giveaways once I get some money under my pockets. Clothing brand on the way as well. But without that being said, let's get started. Yiddy! I'll be on none of that lame. I don't, this, that, I don't speak on that or nothing. Don't get on your Twitch and your chat with a platform. Trying to play my music like mm. it's weak or something, bro. Don't yeah. quit playing with me like that. Nigga, talk about less, less one to one. Over a TikTok clip, mother. Mm. In big 2024, DDG has smoked with yet another content creator. This time is with the five star general and phase member, Blackboy Max. Now, this is not something I expected, but I'm not really surprised about it for one reason. Both of these people are content creators who have their hands in two different parts of the music scene. DDG makes music for mid to high tier mainstream audiences, while Max, who really doesn't take his own music too seriously, caters more to an underground audience, whether that be through reactions or certain events. So, them crossing paths was bound to happen sooner or later. So, let's get into how this whole thing started. I was in the middle of editing another video when I saw a clip on Twitter of DDG calling Max Soft and Deshae Frost chat. I didn't even know DDG watched other streamers outside of the handful of people that he rock with, but I guess. But if you don't know who Deshae Frost is, nowadays he's known for doing the craziest stuff on stream and not getting banned, but I mainly know him as a YouTuber. Yo, homie Max Soft. You talking about, you talking about, uh, why did DDG say homie Max Soft? Max, um... Black boy Max, why you just, why you just, why you just uh, throw a shot of a uh, black boy? He a Damn. Tell him throw the ones. Shortly after the shade would try to get to the bottom of this, playing investigator, calling Max to figure out what's the issue, and Max says that he has no issues. The uh, fat, the fat white boy Lacey too. I don't know what's, I don't know what's going on, bro. But nah, I just thought, I thought y'all, I don't know, I thought y'all. Or whatever. Yeah, I don't know. He beef him with a wall. I don't know, but I <laughs> appreciate you for telling me. Nah, nah, it's good. I, I don't know what he's talking about though. I just make sure it's straight. I'm gonna hit you though after yeah, I get off. Good. I, I don't got no problems with that. Alright, alright, I made you. DDG then caused the Shay on stream to speak on why they're static between him and Max. Mm. Man, I just seen a clip. Him and that little uh Caucasian man in the car laughing and when the nigga said, "Play DDG." Oh. <laughs> Damn. Wait a minute. Why are you even watching that? Why are you worried about how? What? So a nigga, so a nigga get called soft just because somebody laughed when they said play DDG in the car. I ain't gonna laugh. I ain't gonna lie. I wouldn't laugh. I'd just be like, I ain't heard that nigga name in a ox in a minute. Like what? Talking about play DDG, that's a foreign language to me. I ain't heard a good song from you since Moonwalking and the Calabasas and the shit that my cousin put me on to other than that. But I digress. That's just my opinion. If you're going to feel some type of way about that, then keep it to yourself. Bitch. Hell, the nice and then when you get online, you that crazy, bro. Wait, what the f? Oh, you don't like niggas. You said what? I said, oh, oh, there's a clip or something. Just like, yeah, bro, I ain't finna play with no streamers, bro. Be on that internet, but in person, y'all are friendly and shit. you want to get online and laugh. I just don't like playing with me, bro. Yeah, not nah, fair. Like, you nigga, you ain't, ain't had to say my name at all. But he said something too? Nah, he's just laughing like this shit funny, trying to be a little internet, bro. He ain't playing that. And we in the same city. He said he said he was high. He was like he was high. He just said he was high. Man, I don't give a damn, bro. Niggas don't play like that. And I and I met you in person. You don't mm. play with it like that, laughing. Mm. He wants to be. He said he's old. He said he said he said he want to talk. He said he want to add add to the call. I, it's just fresh from my, my mind right now, so I really talk to the later. But it's just like nah. Anybody trying to play with them? I I already dealt with it. They ain't finna play with me this year, bro. If they see me in person, we meet in person, everything's smooth. There should be a different type of respect level. This yeah. internet, because he already he said some weird shit before. 
But I ain't even, when I seen him in person, I was like, man, I ain't even think about that no more. I just let the shit slide or whatever, because he said something mm. like, I ain't gonna lie, my girl still with no 5 DDG songs. Just some little internet. But he said, he but said it's... it slide. He, he said it before, but I'm like, no, I ain't even tripping on that. And I just <laughs> seen a little clip, and he said some little bullshit. And I'm like, hey, bro, bro. I ain't finna let this keep talking crazy, bro. Like the clip DDG is talking about was during the whole beef with Bruce when Max chimed in doing a reaction to I'm geeking and made a joke, which probably made his way back to DDG, who kept that in the back of his mind before they met. Gun to the back of your hotel and name a few songs. I bet money she passing the test. I'm not gonna lie, she probably still fail. You feel I me? Mean? She would just me being objective. I really don't have sides and I don't care. I don't know either of these niggas, you feel me? But she was still failed on no bullshit. In fact, the gun would probably make her fail more, like just the pressure the she failed to The gun would make her fail. See, this is why. As a matter of fact, I'm not. He <laughs> said the gun would make her fail more. <laughs> the gun would make her fail more is crazy. The clip that started all this was from an IRL stream with Max and Lacey. It's pretty self explanatory, so I'll let you see it. Play that new DDG. I can understand how this looks to DDG, but as most clips are, this is out of context, as Max says when he speaks to Deshae. With, with, with artists, what I realized being around artists and stuff like that, bro, like, people treat their music like they baby. You know what I mean? Like, it's different than, like, streams or, like, videos and stuff, but people treat their music like, like, baby, like they baby. And so it's like, when people be, when he feels like, oh, whatever, like, kind of like, like, up, especially since I met you in person, like, we was cool, because I know you, bro, you mad cool and it's I got my foray into an. Mm-hmm. Nah, I would have took that bitch. The same thing with him. It's like he's like, bro, like, what the? F you know what I'm saying? It's like, how you gonna be cool in person and then laugh at the shit I've been working on for years? You know what I'm saying? On, on some inter on, on the internet, you feel what mm -hmm. I'm saying? But you know, this is just a seven seven second clip. I don't know what was going on. I don't know what was going on like that. So, bro, and, but no. and that, and that's cool, bro. But you gotta understand. Bro, the world don't revolve around him. Like, yo, if you if you want to get treated as an artist and you want to be an artist, you got to get critiqued. Yo, bro, I'm sitting in this car. I'm high as... I'm reading the chat. I look over my man's side eye at me because I said, play that DDG. I said that unironically. The side eye at me is funny. I'm alive, my... Not a fucking robot. And right after that, right after this was said, what did I say? Yo, DDG not even bad. DDG got some good songs, though. And my Lacey said... You're right, though. You're right. Like, but he ain't see all that. He's judging off the clip, and he getting butt hurt at mm -hmm. 1 a.m. in the morning. Just say, like, yo, mm -hmm. this, this is not 1 a.m., 1 p.m. Yo, bro, I'm not going to lie. I don't know what to tell this what he wants. I'm not here to beef with nobody. I don't care to do that. I give DDG and show this the love all the time. If he don't see this one little clip and get butt hurt about it and hate hey, or whatever, then so be it. I don't give a but no, I don't know what to tell shit. him, bro. I genuinely don't know what to tell him. Coming oh, on stream shit. saying this is a pussy and saying my friends are like, that's weird, though. I don't like that shit. There's no unnecessary shit. No one was doing all that. He noticed entertainment joke around and play. Why is he talking like that? Just like, yeah. That's weird, though, bro. That's weird. I don't understand that. It's not even on that. I saw this love when I met him at your B, &B. I dapped him up. You feel me, man to man, it's nothing like that. Fast forward a little bit and the two will get into a call to discuss everything. It ain't even on like trolling shit at all, bro. I'm just tired of playing with me, bro. Like I met you in person. It shouldn't be no laughing about nothing dealing with me, bro. I don't laugh at your music and what you be doing. I don't diss you. I don't even speak on you, bro. But like everything is is cool and everything is, is, is regular when you met me in person, right? I'm a regular so it's like when I get online and I see giggling, I don't give a if it said, oh, this was cool afterwards, bro. Like, it's like, why the gotta play with me 24 7? Yeah, I post dad content. Like, I post fucking family. Why the niggas still speaking on my music negatively? Like, you don't have to speak on my shit at all. I don't give a who listen to it. If you don't with it, you ain't gotta speak on it, especially if you met me in person, bro. Like, it's just. It's just weird to me. Bro, it's that simple as a to play your music in chat. My man side eye me. He's clearly Yo, man. Yo, hold on. Let me finish what I'm saying, bro. Yo, he side eye me. The way that looked at me was funny, bro. I said, yo, man, 
Girl, I'm trying to laugh bro, with some props. Bro, I know how to be, I know how to be trolling with me, bro. Like, y'all streamers been doing this for a year now. It's like, it ain't, it ain't no secret, bro. Like, been trolling for a whole fucking year. It's like, when gonna get off my about my music? If you don't fuck with it, then don't fuck with it. It's plain and simple. It's like, especially a with a platform, bro. You knew, you knew I was gonna see this. Shit. It's like, nah, I'm keeping it keep a fuck, platform, yo, bro, bro. Look, no bull. If you, bro, you know you trying to do this music, bro. You know how how much rappers get critiqued. Why are you still worried? I'm not trying to. I'm not. I'm not trying to do. Shit. I'm already double platinum. It's just, it ain't even about that. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't, it's not about, bro, bro, it's not, it's not about, it's not about. It's the fact that he, it's the, I'm not even on nobody's side because at the end of the day, this is not my beef to care about. But at the end of the day, if you gon' if you gon' like he, like Max is saying, if you gonna be an artist, you gotta not let what people say, like, you know, rub you the wrong way, even, even if it's something about your music, it's like, come on now, like, be for real, you, like you said, you went double platinum, so why should somebody's comment like that, you know, rub you the wrong way, and I can also see DDG where he was like, you done laughed, you laughed about, you know, somebody was like, play that new DDG, you laughed about that, and then, you know, in, in my face, you all, but, I can understand both sides, but at the end of the day, you got to learn how to be critiqued. And you're not even letting the nigga say it side. you just over there just, man, I ain't trying to hear that. You, know, you need to calm down with that. That's oh, real uh, shit. rappers get critiqued. I met you. Like, it's different. Like, if I haven't met you before, that's why I ain't trip on the last little thing. You talking about like, like, just some little stream. So I let it slide. I'm like, I never met this. You know, just on some internet shit, it's cool. After I met you, I'm like, oh, okay, cool. You know, just regular n Boom. And then I see this little clip. I'm like, all right, see. Like, still on some little internet shit, bro. That's weird to me. I don't care what nobody say. That's the say You know that weird, bro. Like, Max, you get on stream and you make music and you do it for, you just do it to do it, bro. Like, I'm really spending money on this shit. I'm really sitting in the studio trying to shit. Whether you like it or not, it's like, just really putting their time and effort into this shit. nigga to downplay it that I met. Not saying we like friends or no shit, but it should just be a different respect level, bro. To have more respect for me anyway. It's like we coming from the same world and I'm trying to cross over. If you was trying to get into acting or comedy, I wouldn't be dissing you saying you not funny, you can't act. I'll be pushing for you to win. Like it's it's just it's just weird when you try to try me because I'll be really looking out for I really be yeah. looking for bro. That's just cool. chat. Nah. See the chat the chat is, is the main reason why this even What is up. up everybody? We are Somebody cool. in the chat. You know that's thing cool. You get where you coming from on the whole this is my craft. I want people to take me serious, not disrespect. But again, you are sitting here saying I called your shit. I never did that. Now I know you're sitting there saying, yo, you laughing is implying that, yo bro, I'm literally laughing because I'm smashed this and my man made a funny face at me. When you did that, I don't know what else to tell you. I guess don't. And if you're not willing to watch the rest of the clip, I don't know what to tell you on that either. Yo, bro, you don't know the amount of times I'm, I'm reacting to your shit, and I'm like, you not that bad. Y'all not be about it. But of course you don't see that. Why? Because these clip pages... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Because these clip pages like to post the negative shit. Yo, these... No, I literally be supporting you, bro, and they be hating, but that's just how they are, and you can't... At the end of the day, you gotta do what you're gonna do, and I hope you do that, and I hope you go crazy, because I'm not no hate. This is all entertainment at the end of the day, and I hope you go stupid. I don't got no hate for no I'm just focused on my own shit. But at the end of the day, bro, that little clip, bro, it's not no hate. I was not trying to spread no hate on music. I don't have time to do that. That's mm -hmm. solid and immature. Weird I'm not gonna be here, see or be negative, or be on no catch, or try to get jokes for the stream. I don't want none of that. Like, that's just bad luck, bro. So I'm not here to do that. But what I'm sitting here telling you, when you see a clip like this, it's because I know, hey, bro, that's literally just how I am. I just be trolling. I be having fun. I would never purposely try to down your career or hope you don't make it or nothing like that. So I'm not on that, but bro, I'm not gonna sit here and change who I am and not joke and not do shit. But just know if it's something, when it's something like this, no one's hating on you. No one's trying to make you look crazy or make you look like you less than or you haven't been doing it, bro. It's not that. It's nothing like that. But that's why I don't understand why you're taking it like that. I just took it a certain way because I feel like 
niggas think it's a trend to laugh at my shit, bro. Like, it's it's not cool. And niggas really listen to my shit. They know my shit hard, but niggas gonna give me the hardest criticism because I come from the YouTube shit or I beef with it and do all this other shit. Bro, listen, nobody can even walk two miles in my shoes doing this music. Bro, this shit not easy at all. So I just, I just want a different type of respect level with my music from and, and give me like a fair ear that you would give another that's all i'm asking for bro all that laughing and shit, i know it's clips and all that shit, but that still get taken a certain way and y'all gotta influence if you laugh at my shit, you gonna encourage that 12 year old to laugh at my shit, or you gonna encourage that 15 year old to not take my shit seriously bro like i really put his time and effort into this shit. I I'm just, looking at the chat, respect. That's all it is, bro. I understand where both sides are coming from, but DDG, you can't be out here worrying about hate on top of begging people to respect your music. These internet oh, yeah. niggas are ruthless. They do not care about your feelings, bro. The same day, which was yesterday, Blackboy Max would go on his own stream to address the situation, basically doubling down on what he said, but this time he would equip more animations. That's why this nigga's tight. That's why he called me soft, all of this shit, because niggas giggled when Lacey side eyed me when someone said play DDG. I be trying to tell y'all niggas. I don't know why niggas get so mad easily at me. I don't know what it be, but I don't care to beef or talk to none of you niggas. Now, after this happened, me and me and DDG got on call with the Shay. It was all three of us and the shipping put down. So it's all past. It's not no beef, there's none. Bro, y'all know I'm not trying to be on that negative shit. But yo, bro, I'm gonna keep it all the way a stack. I don't. I didn't see this shit about LA, all this weird shit. You're telling me you seen a TikTok clip, bro, of a nigga not liking your music, potentially, which really, that wasn't even what it was, because you know if you finish the clip, I literally said the nigga got decent songs. You see that, and that you're going to say, we in the same city? You're going to say you're going to slap Lacey? Come on, bro. I, yo, I, I'm telling y'all, niggas really be doing too much. And it's good now, but I did not see this though. This shit, that's lame as fuck. Nigga talking about let's let's run to one over a TikTok clip, motherfucker. Over a TikTok, over a TikTok clip. I did not see none of that. Wait, what? Yo, that's the softest shit in the world. Yo, bro, this awesome transparent keeping it a buck shit. Cause clearly niggas around you not keeping it real. Yo, bro, I said this on the call as well. You can go in the shape uh, vibe for anyone that want to see it. You can go in the vibe, the whole combo there. It was cool. We chopped it up because, bro, DDG is a pioneer. He did a lot of this on his YouTube shit. I respect DDG. But at the end of the day, in terms of this music shit, my nigga, if a nigga don't like your music and you feed into it, what happens every time? Niggas keep eating that nigga alive. Niggas call a whole lot of red ass and what happened? Now nah, niggas love it. Act like it's the greatest album of all time. Yo, bro, as a rap. Looking for an easy. Mmm. He is spin facts on that. You can't. He, he is. He's been there. As a rapper, you gotta make your craft, you gotta believe in your craft, and you gotta let that bitch hang, nigga. Come on, bro. We as streamers, we seen here. You know we joke. You calling us internet niggas. You are bro, the nigga started off as a vlogger. Bro, you know the internet. You're an internet nigga as well. So you know how this shit get. We on stream, we having fun. Why are you saying you're gonna fight niggas, slap niggas? Bro, it's never that serious, bro. But I will never, ever, ever, ever not share my real opinion and what I think with y'all niggas. If I don't like a song, that motherfucking trash. That's how I feel. If I like a song, I'ma say it's good. If I feel this way about a nigga, I'ma say it. Now I've seen the same comments every time DDG has issues with someone's opinion on his music. Some say that he needs a quick buzz or it's a one-sided PR stunt to help his rollout for a new song. I personally don't think this is a PR stunt or anything. Throughout the years, DDG has been very consistent in how he reacts to people he thinks is trolling him or downplaying his craft. We've seen this with Annoying TV, Bruce, Your Rage at some point, and now Black Boy Max. The nigga takes his craft very seriously, so any he thinks is a subliminal shot or hating he's gonna step to you and maybe even try to jump you i'll say what i always say in these situations bro not everyone is gonna like you or your art no matter who you are or what it is you just gotta embrace it just like how you embrace people calling you a youtube rapper you have gold and platinum records as recent as this year so i understand why you have to talk your shit but it really don't be worth it half the time as for max keep the shit pushing but be mindful of how things look bro people are gonna take stuff out of context and they post clips like this all the time and you know you have a big influence just like ddg said so just be mindful of that bro it ain't really that deep man i just have to explain this whole situation in the title don't get too caught up in the title we gonna call it beef or whatever it's not really beef beef but it was yeah this, this shit wasn't even beef it was a misunderstanding 
That that that's what it that's what it was. And yeah, JMB Fargo, thank you. Cause I thought these niggas was really beefing. I was gonna be like, God damn, DDG another one. Bomb, yeah, it's your boy OGT man. And yeah. To be honest, I understand both sides, but at the end of the day, you gotta keep pushing. You can't let shit like that get to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. Doodoo garbage back at it. Nah, y'all not finna start with this. There's no way DDG mad because he Hey man, people people take their crabs here. What is DDG obsession with meeting motherfuckers and thinking they, they have to fight tooth and nail to defend his honor now? He said that same shit to your rage to rage. Oh god. Honestly, I don't even know why DDG getting mad over a clip that was out of context. As an artist, content creator, athlete, etc., you're going to face some criticism during and throughout your career. Facts. Ooh, excuse me. What I got to say about it, keep it pushing. That, that's all I got to say. It, it wasn't even that deep. But anyways, it's your boy OGT man. Oh, no, no. Got that. Anyways, it's your boy OGT man signing out on the road to... 10k at 2300 i will be doing long close to long vlogs on that that being said we gone thank you jmp fargo and now we out steam